In the heart of Mother Nature, where compassion meets devotion, a journey of love and care began a decade ago. Welcome to Dakshin Vrindavan Gaushala, our attempt to serve cows and bulls rescued from slaughter, which is dear most seva to Shri Krishna. For the past 10 long years, we have been tirelessly committed to rescuing cows and bulls from the harsh clutches of slaughter and providing them a safe and a loving home. Our Goshala is blessed with trustees from all walks of life. The revered Tantri of Padmanabha Swami Temple, Tiruvananthapuram, accomplished software engineers from Microsoft, Cognizant, lawyers and more. Ensuring that we operate at practically zero administrative costs, every single penny you donate goes directly to the care and welfare of our cows and bulls. From the innocent wheel calves to strong bulls, every single soul we rescue carries a story, a story of survival, a story of resonance. The cruelty they are subjected is unspeakable. Green chilies are inserted into the eyes of the cows by butchers while transporting them to slaughter. We host many such cows who have gone blind by such process. Today, we serve and host around 400 of these beautiful cows and bulls, each one cherished and each one loved. Thanks to the generous support of our incredible donors, we've been able to purchase a 9-acre property and construct comfortable sheds for 300 of our cows. Shilanyas was conducted by none other than our own trustee, Tarananallur Sadishan Dambudri Pad, the Tantri of Patnapha Swami Temple, in December 2021. It took us about one and a half years to construct Two sheds. We are proud to introduce you to our two completed blocks, the Radharaman block and Govardhan block. Each of these homes can accommodate up to 150 cows and they are already enjoying their new spaces. It wasn't easy to have them built considering the scarcity of funds we face as these are non-recurring expenses apart from the medical and feeding expenses. Our third shed with the capacity to house another 150 cows is swiftly nearing completion. We have also constructed a building equipped with a godown to store food for our cows and quarters for our dedicated workers. The space can comfortably accommodate up to 50 workers ensuring that as our family grows, we have manpower and facility to take care of them. Harnessing the rich resources offered by our cows, we have built a facility for manufacturing cow dung products like dhoop and incense. We have also constructed a separate shed for storing grass. We treat a lot of sick cows and those rescued from slaughter, those abandoned by farmers, and those injured on highways. However, we lack a proper hospital facility. We dream of a fully equipped cow hospital with modern amenities like x-ray, scanning machines, ICU facilities, where our divine Gaumata can receive the best care. But we need your help to make this dream a reality. Please, we kindly urge you to consider supporting us in constructing a hospital for our cows. Your contribution will bring us a step closer to offering them the medical care they deserve. Please join us by becoming a life member of Dakshin Vrindavan. Your membership will not only support our cause, but also make you a part of our extended family. We have floated a life membership program at Dakshin Vrindavan to found this noble cause. 
The benefits of this membership will be available the moment we inaugurate the Goshala, which is planned for 2024. Together, we can create a space where pujas and havans are conducted by traditional learned pundits for our life patrons, where every move is a song of gratitude, where every wagging tail is a rhythm of happiness. In the heart of Dakshin Vrindavan, let us create a symphony of love, care and compassion. Join us on this beautiful journey. There is no other way to please Sri Krishna than serving cows rescued from slaughter. If one delivers a cow from a dangerous situation, from being struck in the mud or from being attacked by a tiger, one obtains the result of performing a Ashwamedha Yaga. Vishnu Dharmotra Purana, Part 3, Chapter 291 Please kindly help us in our endeavors to serve the cows. We purely depend upon your mercy to rescue and feed the cows and bulls.